Hi, today I'm going to talk about vision boards uh, and dream boards and what are they and how to make one that really resonates with you. Um, so they are a collection of images um, and, and artworks that, is, that really sort of resonate with you, that depicts your intention and your goals for this coming year. So being January, the start of a new year, so it's a great time to reassess your goals and see um, where you'd like your life to be headed this year. So I'll just go a, a, few, a few of my pictures. Um, these, this all, these all pictures really make me smile, which is really great. So you want them to sort of be, you know, if you love colour, like I'm really sort of a visual person, so I love all the colour and things like that. I love the words and these great images that I want to sort of come true and putting my intentions out there for 2014. So I just cut this one out of um, it's Time to Shine, right there in the middle. I cut that out um, from a tea box. Um, and the other pictures I've got, I've just sort of screenshotted them from uh, Instagram or Google Images and then printed them out at Kmart. So really easy and simple to do and stuff that's going to um, sort of supposed to draw your goals towards you. So I made one like this similar last year and the majority of them had come true. So you're going to be going about your day and having these, these visions um, of the images that you'd like to come true in sort of the forefront of your mind, you're sort of going to be making these great decisions to, that are moving you towards your goals um, rather than, than away from them. So I've got a few um, sort of physical activities, sort of fitness goals here. I've got um, a fair few yoga moves. There's um, lots that have, um, yeah, this one I really love from Beach Girl Yoga on Instagram. There's lots of these yoga moves. I really want to get my body um, back up to scratch uh, to be practicing a lot of yoga, to do my yoga teacher training in the middle of the year, which I'm really, really looking forward to. So that's all these, these lovely pictures there. I've got someone, um, Surfing on the beach, really want to be doing that again, which is good. I've got miracles happen when you expect them. I had this one from last last vision board, but I just really love it. It's all um, and just appreciating little miracles that are having happening to you throughout your day. I've got um, dance over here. I, I do a little dance every time I do like a blog post or uh, send out like a newsletter. Um, which is good. I just do a little dance wherever I am, on my study or in the kitchen, wherever, which makes me very happy. So hopefully, to, like uh, this coming year, I'll be dancing a lot more, doing lots and lots more happy dances. Last year, I danced a lot to, um, it was a good Robert DeLong song, um, and the main chorus is, did I leave my life to chance or did I make it effing dance? And so... With this whole creation of the dream boards, we're not really leaving our, our life to chance. We're sort of, we're, we're putting it out there. This is what we're wanting. It's like rocking, that sort of analogy of rocking out to a restaurant and um, getting served something and then going, oh, I did not, didn't order this. This isn't what I want. Well, what, what did you want? So set your order out um, to the universe um, and, and hopefully with these in the forefront of your mind, you'll be drawing them to you. I've also got retreat up here, so I want to start to run a few um, wellness retreats, which is really, really fun. That really gets me excited. So um, after I go away and do a yoga teacher training in Mexico, I can come back and do some, some retreats, which is really good. I've got my nan here, you can see. Um, she's my yogi inspiration. I remember that she would have been about 60 in this picture. She um, was doing headstands right up until... Um, just before she passed away, she was in her 70s, so that's really cool. Love that. We've got the um, very fit Rachel Guy here, um, smashing out some chin ups, which I really wanted to get up to 10 unassisted chin ups, so it's another one of my good goals. Peru hiking, I've got another one, um, get a bandstand over here um, at the top of a mountain. Hiking, I wanted to get, be doing a lot of that up. A lot more hiking this year. You can you can write words on there. I've just written speaker there. I want to be uh, uh, get my public speaking up to, up to scratch, um, which is really good. Just anything that really resonates with you, something that's going to um, ignite happiness and, and going to 
put you in a, a, like a better mood for the day. I usually, like I've got mine up in my room. In the mornings or the afternoons when I'm feeling a bit, a bit crappy, I'll just go and look at it and it really will make me smile. So that's the, that's the really goal for it. Um, you can also make them into iMovies. I think you can screenshot a lot of pictures, uh, save a lot of pictures to your image, uh, to your images and then um, put them all into a, a video format. So that's that can be really good and you can add music to that also and dance along if, if you like. So that's it for today. Uh, if you like it, comment and share. If you need any help with your goals, um, I'm obviously available for you. Uh, I'm doing a, a $50 off for my three month program that's coming up. So if you're interested in that, uh, send us an email at kimthewellness at gmail.com and also if you need any other um, help with your goal setting if you're not quite sure um, what sort of goals you want to be doing um, or what sort of pictures you, you, you need um, I've just completed my um, Leonie Dawson's um, amazing life workbook and I've got a link to that um, underneath this post because that was that really helps you sort of um, ask a lot of uh, great great questions and get you thinking about the year to come and what you'd like to achieve out of that year. So don't leave your life to chance and I hope you'll be dancing a lot in 2014.